Is the Philippines the vlogging capital of the world? It's a bold question but one that might just hold some truth. In recent years the Philippines has seen a significant boom in vlogging. It's not just a passing fad, it's a cultural phenomenon. A new way Filipinos communicate, learn, and get entertained. Why is this the case? Well let's delve into the numbers. Reports suggest that a staggering number of Filipinos are tuning into vlogs regularly. This isn't just a small group of tech-savvy individuals, it's a substantial portion of the population from all walks of life, from the bustling streets of Manila to the serene beaches of Palawan. So, what's causing this shift? The answer lies in the rich content that the Philippines offers. This archipelago with its more than 7,000 islands is a treasure trove of stunning landscapes and vibrant culture. From the chocolate hills of Bohol to the world-renowned beaches of Boracay, from the bustling streets of Manila to the serene terraces of Banaue, every corner of the Philippines has a story to tell. And what better way to share these stories than through vlogs? But it's not just about the places. It's about the people. Filipinos are known around the world for their warmth and hospitality. They welcome visitors with open arms and wide smiles, making them feel at home. This friendly and welcoming nature of Filipinos makes the Philippines not just a dream destination for travelers, but also a goldmine for vloggers looking for engaging and heartwarming content. So yes, the Philippines is indeed experiencing a vlogging boom. The blend of breathtaking landscapes, vibrant culture and friendly locales make it a perfect canvas for vloggers to paint their stories. But the question remains, what happens when vloggers from other parts of the world visit the Philippines? So, the Philippines is indeed a hotspot for vlogging, but what happens when vloggers from other parts of the world visit the Philippines? Imagine you're a vlogger and you've just landed in the Philippines, what happens next? Picture this, you're a travel vlogger and you've just touched down in Manila. With camera in hand, you step out into the hustle and bustle of the city, capturing the vibrant street life, the towering skyscrapers, and the warm smiles of passers-by. You upload the video and before you know it, it's making waves online, garnering thousands of views and shares. Or perhaps you're a food vlogger, reveling in the rich culinary scene of the Philippines. From the savory adobo to the sweet halo halo, you're recording every bite, every flavor. Your audience watches in fascination as you introduce them to a world of food they've never tasted before. The video explodes in popularity, your subscribers count surges, and your comment section floods with requests for more Filipino dishes. Now, envision yourself as a lifestyle vlogger, exploring the vibrant Filipino culture, the colorful festivals, the traditional music, the intricate dances. You're not just creating a video, you're weaving a story, a narrative that draws viewers in and leaves them wanting more. And just like that, your vlog becomes the talk of the town, the trending topic, the viral sensation. It could even be that you're a fashion vlogger, documenting the unique blend of traditional and modern styles in the Philippines. The colorful jeepneys become your backdrop as you strut down the streets of Manila in local designs. Your video is a hit, a testament to the global appeal of Filipino fashion. And this, my friends, is just the tip of the iceberg. Vloggers from all genres are finding success in the Philippines, tapping into the country's rich tapestry of experiences and sharing them with the world. And just like that, a vlog shot in the Philippines goes viral. But why? What makes these vlogs stand out? As we delve deeper into the world of Filipino vlogging, we'll uncover the secret sauce that's making the Philippines a hotbed for viral content. So stay tuned! What makes a vlog shot in the Philippines go viral, you might ask? Well, it's not just one thing, but a combination of many unique elements that set Filipino vlogs apart. First and foremost, the country's natural beauty is absolutely breathtaking. From the crystalline waters of Palawan's beaches, to the majestic Mayan volcano's perfect cone, the Philippines is a paradise for visual storytelling. Every corner of the archipelago is a feast for the eyes, a vibrant canvas for vloggers to paint their stories on. But what's a beautiful landscape without warm and hospitable people to populate it? That's where the Filipinos themselves come in. Known worldwide for their friendliness and hospitality, Filipinos are often the heart and soul of these vlogs. Their smiles are infectious, their laughter is contagious, and their stories are as colorful as the country they call home. It's no wonder that viewers from all around the globe are captivated by the genuine interactions that unfold between vloggers and the local people. Then let's not forget the unique Filipino culture that's rich in history and customs. 
It's a culture that's brimming with vibrant festivals, flavorful cuisine, and a unique blend of Eastern and Western influences. The Sinulog Festival in Cebu, the Pahias Festival in Lukban, the mouth-watering Adobo in Lachan, these are just a few examples of the cultural treasures that vloggers can share with their audience. And of course there's the Filipino spirit, resilient and ever joyful, that shines through even in the most ordinary moments. This spirit, this Bayanihan, is truly something to behold, something that adds an extra layer of depth to every vlog shot in the country. So it's clear that the Philippines offers a unique blend of elements that make vlogs shot here go viral. But what does this mean for the future of vlogging in the Philippines? With its vibrant vlogging scene and its appeal to vloggers worldwide, what does the future hold for vlogging in the Philippines? The future of vlogging in the Philippines is bright and holds immense potential. As the digital landscape continues to evolve, the number of vloggers in the country is expected to increase. There's a sense of anticipation in the air as more and more Filipinos discover the joy of creating and sharing content online. This boom is not just limited to local talents but also international vloggers who are drawn to the country's unique charm and vibrant culture. The rise of vlogging in the Philippines opens up a world of opportunities. For local vloggers it offers a platform to showcase their creativity, tell their stories, and connect with audiences on a deeper level. For international vloggers it's a chance to explore a new culture, share their experiences, and contribute to the global narrative about the Philippines. But the impact of this vlogging revolution extends beyond the digital realm. It's transforming the Philippines' tourism and digital economy. As vloggers showcase the country's stunning landscapes, rich history and warm hospitality, they're inviting the world to come and experience the Philippines for themselves. This not only boosts tourism but also creates jobs and stimulates the economy. The future of vlogging in the Philippines also promises a more inclusive and diverse digital space. As more voices join the conversation, we're likely to see a wider range of perspectives and stories being shared. This enriches the online community and fosters a sense of unity and understanding among viewers. In this digital age, the power of storytelling is more potent than ever. And vlogging is a medium that amplifies this power, allowing stories to be told in a personal and engaging way. The Philippines, with its rich tapestry of stories waiting to be told, is perfectly poised to ride this wave. As we look to the future, one thing is clear. The Philippines is not just the vlogging capital of the world, but a place where stories come alive and capture the hearts of viewers worldwide.